If you're like me, you've already started your barbecue this season and cooked a couple of fabulous meals on the back deck with the weather that we've been having. And if you're like me, and hopefully you're not, you've done some safety checks before you brought the barbecue out for the first time this season. You meshes with the Nanaimo Fire Department, a fire prevention officer, and we're hauling out the barbecue, let's say for the first time this year. And it's been stored outside? all year on the back deck underneath a, uh, a cover. That's how it is at my house. What should I be doing before I fire it up? Well, the first thing you should be doing is just making sure that all the equipment is uh, in working order. So what you can do is you can open the, the bottom, open the top, and just confirm that there's nothing inside here. Like over the winter, yeah. uh, we had at our house frogs inside here. Oh inside my gosh, here. frogs. Yes. Some people would, did you barbecue them? No, 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 no. <laughs> but, my, 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 but my wife freaked out on that. So it was quite funny actually. <laughs> yeah, but she you got like them frogs. out. But you wouldn't have known that they were there if you hadn't exactly. checked. Exactly. Right. And, in the, and in the burners, you should check for spiders and cobwebs because spiders lay eggs in the burners. Right. So that will cause an issue if the first time uh, turning it on. Because so they'll catch on fire. Exactly, and they'll clog it up. So all you have to do is just check underneath, make sure there's nothing going on, check from from all the uh, the whole barbecue, right. and check to just make sure there's nothing out of the ordinary going on. Okay. And then you have to do a uh, soap test. Oh, so okay. all this here's is, the soap. All of this is is dishwashing soap, and what you're going to do is put it at all the connections okay. from the tank coming up to the barbecue, All right. and you check for bubbles. So we'll put some soap and he's just putting it on there with a spoon yep. at all the places where there's a connection or a potential for a leak. Exactly. Okay. And what is it that causes these leaks? I mean, is it just sort of Just time? wear and tear. Yeah. Wear and tear. Right? So then okay. after you've done that, then you turn the tank on. This part always scares me a little bit. You turn it on, right? Yeah. And then you'll be able to see if, if it starts bubbling. If it starts bubbling, there's a leak. So you shouldn't be using it at this time. That means it's unsafe. So if there's no leaks, then you can carry on and turn it on the barbecue. Okay, now turning it on is another part that freaks me out, to be honest. I'm imagining that the igniter on this machine, which is a beautiful barbecue, by the way, works properly. Yes. But quite often the igniters go. Yes. And I'm one of those ones with a, a lighter and I'm... Yeah, it shouldn't be a small, like for example, Bic lighter. It should right. be a, a, in length. You can get them from uh, hardware stores, and you—it's like a long match, basically. Right. And you—and it's safe as long as you're not going like this. Right. You have to be. And a far little bit of away. a hoof is yes. normal. Exactly. Okay. It is. <laughs> That's good to but know. the thing is, you don't turn on all the burners. You just turn on one, right? Right. You always have the lid open. You never turn it on with the lid closed. Okay. So that's a bigger woof, and that's not safe. That's not, okay. So then you just turn it on, one burner, hit the ignition, Okay. and there it's on. There we go. Yep, and then slowly you can turn on all the burners, right? You don't turn them all on at the same time because then you'll have a, it's a bigger potential of hurting yourself. Okay, well, we don't want that, yep. and uh, we're going to come back later on this edition of Go with a few more little tips to make sure that your grilling season Stay safe. You're watching Go.